Hey girl, do you want to learn how to date offline and meet men in real life? Now I hear it all day, every day. I'm tired of these apps. They're lame. They're tiring. They're exhausting. Let's learn how to meet them in real life. And I'm going to teach you how to do that. Okay. Now, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Anwar White. I'm a dating coach for smart and successful black and brown women. And I'm going to spill some tea on what I tell my clients and what has been really successful for them. Now, as you may know, these men are not approaching you like they used to. Now, we are in a post me to environment where men do not want to be considered a harasser or a perv. And we're also in a post pandemic society. And so that means that men are not going to be kind of encroaching on your space the way that they used to. So it provides a, a few challenges when it comes to offline dating. But girl, I got you. I'm going to show you how to make it happen. I think of men kind of like straws. I know it sounds weird, but the old school straws, the plastic ones were like not so good for society, but they did the job, right? They made it happen. You got your drink. These kind of these new school straws, the paper ones, they're softer and they break down and they're not able to do the job as well. This is how men are acting, especially when it comes to offline. They're scared a little bit of rejection and I get that. So. What does that mean? That means that you have to, what I call, open up the space and you have to start having conversations with these men. And there are three ways that I recommend doing it. Number one, give them a compliment. Hey, I love that watch. Where did you get it from? Number two, ask for a recommendation. Hey, I don't know what, I, I don't know what to get here. What do you usually get here? Number three, ask for help. Hey, can you get that can of soup for me up there? Those are three ways to open up the space, start the conversation. Your job is just to start the conversation and then he can drive the conversation and finish it, okay? Now I hear you, most women out there will tell me, Amwar, girl, like, I don't wanna be rejected. I don't wanna put myself out there. I got you, girl. Here's what you wanna do. One, look at the feet, girl. The feet will tell you everything that you need to know if this guy is feeling you or not. Why? Well, because one, that's Body Language 101. And two, girl, it is a proven strategy. I used to do this as a gay man, so I knew exactly what guys were checking for me or not. It never fails, okay? Now, I hope this helps. And if you wanna learn more, please um, book a call with me. I'd love to help. But in the comments, let me know, how do you meet men in real life?